Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Superbase auth example. Today we are going to learn about the sign up with the phone and the password. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So here we have the passwords based auth. So sign up with phone number and the password. Okay, so there is a method that is superbase.auth dot sign up that we are going to use and it accepts phone and the password another thing if you have the phone verification turned on then the user receives an sms with a six digit pin that you want must verify okay let's have a look so it's better that we can enable the phone verification turned on okay so how we are going to do that let's have a look okay so go to the auth provider page okay select your project here we have a phone enable the phone provider i'm going to use the twilio let's log in with the twilio and fill up the details it's twilio okay so here we go with this one let's log in and i'm i think i'm logged in no then it's asking for the verification then otp also or otp is skipped yes Okay, I'm logged in. So let's put the details. So here we have account SID. So let's put the account SID over here. Next, we have a token. So let's copy this token and paste it over here. Next, we have a Twilio message service ID. Let's have a look message service ID. Let's go to the messaging. We have a uh, messaging senders let's have a look uh, we have the senders or not settings no let's try it out services so messaging service okay so make it here to go and make a text messaging service create message services because here we require messaging service id so we have to add senders so phone number continue so let's check this and uh, add phone number okay now let's go to the this is done set up the integration okay add this one and here we go with complete the messaging services try the message right so i will get the messaging service id now So send to the personal number. So the phone number is gonna be like this. Messing services. I want to click. Select the messing services this is test. So this is my service ID. Let's copy and paste this and use it. Okay. And that's it. SMS OTP expiration and your code is you can customize the message and save this. Okay, done. Let's go and just uh, fill the details over there. Because I think the project is not, I'm using the details of it. Here we go with our API. Not this. We have to go with settings. We have to go with API. We have to go with the URL. So copy this. And this is code base. Let's go to Superbit client. Let's paste this. The project. So Superbase URL. Let's make it word wrap. Okay. And let's go with copy with anon key. Okay, let's paste it. Done. Let's restart the project or it's automatically restarted. Okay. But here node modules, this let me just clear this. RM minus R RM RF node modules okay npm i so this is done let's play around with npm start okay so now it's okay now let's put the phone number so plus nine and the password I'm going to make it like this sign up
phone signups are disabled let me check what exactly it is so let me go to the providers but I have updated all the details let me reload I think it's disabled currently I need to enable it because details I have put it up but I am not uh, enabled it save this ok let's go and check ok fine let's again do the sign up error into the phone number 9 it's not a valid phone number ok let me check what exactly the valid phone number is but it's my valid phone number which is my numbers let me check the phone numbers manage active numbers where is my number then this is the number I anything issue two number let me check which is the two number overview try it out failed reason two phone numbers supplied was a no, not a valid number was incorrectly formatted and accepts the phone number with the country um, plus with country code including the area code what we have done okay so we haven't add the plus nine one let's check now OTP sent please verify let me check where is my phone Just give me one minute and now we I come with back my phone number yes I received the OTP let's verify it okay enter the OTP verification number that is okay let's verify OTP verified now you are signed in right so this is how we are able to log in with the phone number with verify otp with twilio so this is how you can do that any doubt any query in that please do let me know in the comment section let's dive into the code level which i'm not showing that code level okay so this is superbase client which we require superbase url and the superbase anon key so where you can get it i already explained now we have the odd.js where we have the, all the functionality so you have to import the react and the use state and the superbase client from the superbase client right so auth these are all the states okay so phone password otp session loading and everything then we have a handle sign up which requires the phone and the password and uh, then set the otp to be true okay if something goes wrong it will go to the catch block then set loading to be false now handle verify OTP so there is a method that is auth dot verify OTP which requires the phone number token should be the OTP and the type should be the SMS okay then set the session accordingly okay and if something goes wrong go to the catch blog and finally set the loading to be false okay then here we have a sign up with the phone if there is a no OTP then we have an input with phone number and the password okay when click on that one then handle sign up then loading is to be loading then sign up okay after that if it is not OTP is not there if OTP already sent then we have to make or uh, enter OTP screen with handle verify OTP function where we click on it that will help you to verify the OTP okay then loading to be true then verify OTP then if the session is coming up then we are making it make it as like sign in as session dot user dot phone okay because we have logged in with the phone and the password so we will receive the session of the user with the help of the session dot user dot phone okay so any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to like share and comment on my video okay thank you so much have a great day